Lisa Edelstein stars in season two of The Kaminsky oh. Method with Michael Douglas and Alan Arkin. Oh, it's one of the best shows. She's a complete scene stealer okay. as the just daughter we could not get enough of. So, Lisa, we uh, started off dedicating a refrigerator to Fluffy. Is there anything okay. you'd like to take home, perhaps? Yes. That chair looks nice. Um, I, I don't know. I think you should just get a room. I think you should just name a room. <laughs> Battlestein room. You know, it's just like, it's good to know there's a room somewhere with your name on it. Right. <laughs> and Lisa and I were talking. She's been here. We've been on 10 years, so we've, we've yeah. gone through everything. Yeah. Girlfriend's Guide to Divorce. People are still losing oh, their mind yeah. over. So Is it funny. true you were just accosted nude at the gym by a fan <laughs> oh. who had some yes. questions she needed to bond? Yeah, it was so funny. I was, I was literally putting my clothes on when this woman was like, Oh my God! Girlfriend got you divorced. I was like, yes, <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's me. You bond uh, very quickly that yeah. way, right? <laughs> <laughs> it was really funny. She did not care that I was naked. No, she was very excited. I was a little more concerned with my nudity. And <laughs> um, then I was like, God, was I, did my body compare to how? Oh my God, I was worried about so many things. But she was really just excited about the show. That's it's so sweet. Girlfriend's Guide is so personal to people. It's because, so yeah. personal. Yeah. Well, each one of the characters, I think you can see part of yourself in. Sure. Yeah. But you seem to land in these roles and Kaminsky Method. They're so rich and you yeah. make them your own. Oh, thank What you. are we going to see with your character? Please oh, keep season? her a little more train wrecky. I, we <laughs> like her like that. I this. know. I was like, please don't get her too healthy yeah. too fast. Um, no, you know, the funny thing about That's Phoebe is like, she's re she really means it. And Chuck really wanted to make sure that she's trying to get sober and she means it. Um, my favorite episodes are a little bit like, I think season, like towards the end of the season where she's trying to make amends because you start to see that her, her value system is still a bit off. <laughs> and you also see the dynamic with her dad and, and what sort of helped build this person with so many addiction problems. <laughs> it's really fun. I love working with Alan and Michael's so sweet. Yeah, I mean, working with Michael Douglas, Alan Arkin, when yeah. you heard that. I was like... thrilled. And Chuck. I mean, yeah. what a great group. Right. Uh, Michael is has been famous for so long that he just thinks everybody knows everything about him. So he <laughs> he sort of starts mid conversation, <laughs> which is hilarious. I'm That's like, great. I don't read those articles, <laughs> so I don't know what you're talking about. Um, but uh, uh, he's he's fantastic, and and it's not just Alan and Michael and Chuck. It's like this bevy of guest stars that keep showing up. I mean, Anne Margaret came oh. last oh, year wow. yeah. and couldn't get on the lot because she forgot her ID. Oh. Who doesn't like, like Anne Margaret? It's, it's Anne Margaret. That's a, that's a sin. Uh, Wait, anyway. so what happened? They, 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 she had to go back and get ID. Oh and then, I mean, it's so With cool. like a name tag, like the handwriting. It's that Anne Margaret. Like, just do a YouTube yeah, exactly. video. Exactly. You Google. and Elvis dancing. It's exactly. Exactly. I mean, what she's, came to mind. Anne, she's a legend. Paul Reiser's on this season. He has a bald cap on. Um, that was, I did the very first episode of Mad About You. So, oh, wow. um, not the pilot, but the the first episode yeah. that they were a series, so I, we have fond memories of that. What was your character from Adam? I it? was an ex-girlfriend of his that he thought uh, he thought my character was brokenhearted by him and in love with him, and my character and Helen Hunt finds out that my character really just it really didn't care at all. Um, and there's some fun like home movies that are supposed to be from the 70s. Anyway, it was really you cute. You played the best girlfriend. Do you remember her Seinfeld character? What was it? You were the the risotto the girl. The orga the yes, yeah. The orgasmic girl. Wait, here yeah. we go. Look at this picture. Oh, oh I love that gosh. picture. I could relate. I love risotto. Right? That was like, <laughs> and I was I, I was smoking in the episode. Like you don't really see that anymore. No, no that's so right. Funny. Back in the day, yeah. they used to, right? Yeah. Oh no. my gosh. I had to eat and smoke. And moan in very quick successions. So I was like, how am I going to make this seem like it's... <laughs> yeah, <right>. seamless. <laughs> oh. It worked. I was like, it was very hard to do. It was stunt acting. You also have a couple boys. That, I do. Uh, I have two right stepsons. I have a 12-year-old and a 14-year-old. Oh, that's, that's a lot um, of little stuff. The 14-year-old looks right like he's 17. Oh, really? And, and it's no joke. And it's like he looks so mature that we have to tell women to just lay off. You're like, lay off? Uh, yeah, 14. He that's is 14. Mario had muscles. He looked like a man when you were very young. Yeah, that's like, <laughs> that's like our <laughs> you older. You watched it. Thank you. Right yeah. 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 <laughs> no, it's yeah. a compliment. Yes. And our 12-year-old our is like super into anime and D Dungeons and & Dragons and... It's, it's great. I love this age so much. I mean, especially 12. 12 is great because testosterone hasn't just sort of like That's flooded your whole brain. It's, right. it's um, coming, though. It's coming, but you get that moment in between childhood and adulthood where they're still mushy and yummy and they want to talk about things, right. um, but they're mature, so they have 
they have the language to communicate. It's, sure. it's a beautiful age. I used to think I would never want to hang out with junior high school kids, but <laughs> it's actually my favorite, so far my favorite age. Huh. I love this and where you are with your career and your life. Her darling husband paints her nude. They have this great <laughs> relationship. Oh, that's a fun like, fact. I'm serious about oh, how beautiful oh, this is. I like Look they had that. to like, they had to blur my butt crack. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful butt crack for the PG record. 13. We yeah, we don't PG know. 13. We don't know who doesn't have one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You gotta be careful. Uh, uh, Somebody might be offended. Yes, we don't we don't want that. Well, in, in the meanwhile, uh, season two of the yeah. Kaminsky Method is streaming now on Netflix. Great to see you, Thank Lisa. You so much. As always, so come nice back to and play. You too.